Howdy. Talking to you from the far reaches of Idaho, Sandpoint, outside of Sandpoint, which is about, oh, I don't know, a couple hours from the Canadian border. Uh, I'm walking, I'm house sitting up here for an old friend of mine for about three weeks, and I'm walking two of their dogs, both Australian Shepherds that need a lot of work. So we're on a few mile hike here up in, I don't know where I'm at, it's outside of Sandpoint, it's a trail I found. Uh, Zephyr and Vino, if you see them running by me frantically, that's who they are as they explore. Um, hope you had a holy, good holiday. Now we're coming up onto the new year and uh, 2020 is going to be an amazing year, I mean for all of us. And I mean that in a really good general way. There's a lot of changes going on, which I'll talk about more on this planet and in each individual, and it's all for the better. There's gonna be a lot of chaos, more chaos coming, but through that, there will be good. People are just, people are finally starting to what I call wake up and reclaim their lives like I did. Reclaim my health, reclaim my sanity, reclaim my mental health, my spiritual health. Healthy body, healthy mind, healthy soul, they all go together. And the more I travel, the more people I'm running into to, or do a walking the same path and through that there will be a peace peaceful resistance probably not a right word but there will be change coming <clears throat> it's happening now but you know I always like to talk I was you know, so good to reflect at the end of the year um, coming and going and relationships are a wonderful thing people come into our lives sometimes for shorter periods sometimes for longer periods but it's all perfect. Meaning, there are people that will come in briefly. One of my favorite quotes are, everything is a lesson. Everything is. We may not see it at the time when we're in the midst of our really down times, breakups, bad parts of life, whatever. But you get through it and you look back, you'll understand a lesson came from it. Hopefully, most of us. We still do have those people we know that that definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different outcome. They just take a little longer to learn their lessons. But it's the same thing with people and relationships. People come into our lives as teachers. They come in sometimes very briefly. It could be lovers, it could be friends, it could be associates, business associates, family. Others stay for longer periods of time, others around for a lifetime. So it's important to remember that, especially when we're going through our times. You can't force anything or control anything, but when you're left scratching your head on why this so-called person came in and then left, there's reasons for that. Sometimes it can be very difficult. But again, it's all about letting go, which you've heard me say it before. And everything's in perfect order, always. <clears throat> Um, but it's beautiful. So, keep trodden forward in your life. The beauty's in making small steps forward. Rome wasn't built in a day. And it's never too late to change. And I'm helping a lot of people with that. I completely turned my life around at 45 years old. And now I know my true calling is helping people heal, helping them in their lives. That's where my passion is. And you'll find yours if you have it yet. Just be open. Okay, well, I may be posting before the new year, but if I don't, have a great new year. And I'll talk to you in 2020. Keep signing out.